Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Mark of the Ninja. I'm your host VGM Corin, and in the last one we got the final mark from Dosan right before he died and used its power to get through the desert and return home to our ninja dojo. Now we're going to go ahead and confront Master Azai. Let's get started. As soon as I press the right buttons. When you meet your friends, your master, will you be ready? Here we are. I don't think anyone will be pleased to see us. And as you might have noticed, the background... There's the secret entrance. Remember the key. Hidden in light, shown in shadow. The background for this level is rather different. You might see that there's a tiger there, and a spider up there, and all manners of interesting beasts. Now, you might remember from, well, the fact that I've been talking about for pretty much every episode, but getting the mark of the ninja gradually makes you go insane. Could these things be related, or is it possible that last time we were here, we just neglected to notice all this high-tech technology, and sky things. What? What is... Oh, okay, there's something down there. I can not see that. I should have made this game maybe a little bit brighter, or actually, I can see it fine now that I'm looking at, so yeah. As always, the Mark of Serenity is necessary for these last few levels in order to beat them at all. You don't get a choice in the style you play for these levels, which... It's a mixed thing. While the, this path is extremely fun, it is kind of sad that you end up not being able to play quite as many levels with other with the other play styles. Now, it's generally not a bad thing. It's just something worth noting. But in story progression, the Mark of Serenity is actually a lot of, I squished. The Mark of Serenity is a lot of fun to use. All right, let's do this again. No, not there. Go ahead and turn that back on one more time, and let's try this without me getting horribly maimed and murdered. By the way, how would anyone without the Mark of Serenity be able to get through here? They couldn't. It would not be possible. But... We've used these tunnels countless times to sneak out on missions. But this must be the first time anyone's used them to sneak in. That seems likely. Like many final levels, the design of this place is less sensical and more this is a final dungeon and we're going to throw all the traps in the game at you. I mean, have you ever noticed that about games? Like, even if your final level is just a corporate headquarters? Are, right? Are the hallucinations getting stronger? You have to be careful. You may start to see enemies who aren't even there. And if your mind thinks you've been shot, your body will believe it. All right, with that Those traps advice. Will kill you, and so will the train. There's a reason no one but us ever uses these tunnels. By the way, your partner talks a lot in this particular episode. She does that anyways, but worth noting. Anyways, we can go ahead and sneak by since we don't have a sword. But as I was saying, final levels in games tend to be a little on the ridiculous side. What do I mean by that? Well, for example, if your final level is a corporate headquarters, it's going to be a corporate headquarters with, say, a uh, Pokemon style Silphco. Silphco, that's the one I'm looking for, with teleporters. Why? Because why not? I don't know. Let's go ahead and distract them. And... Run. Oh, that was closer than I would like it to be. Now, I'm... Oh god, trains. Thankfully, trains aren't the worst thing. Oh god. Well, getting electrocuted is probably the lesser of the two evil fates there. Let's go ahead and get there. You have to be quick in this level, but no more so than you would usually have to play anyway. Anyways. Before we go any further, you'll need weapons. Old Tyra always kept plenty on hand at the top of the watchtower. So she did. Oh god. Ah, I hate traps like that. 
I really, really do. I mean, to be fair, if I had gone over here, I would have saw, oh, those are going to shoot me. La 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 la, I'll just move this out of the way, like a smart person. But I can't be smart all the time. But really, anything that shoots you from off screen is a little bit frustrating to deal with. Why am I doing this? What purpose does this serve me? I don't really know, actually. Can I teleport up there? Was there any reason to do that whatsoever? Probably not. I don't think I need to move that at all. Good old Tyra. Even in death, you never let us down. And finally, of course, we get our last checkpoint in the game, which seems like the point to pick up superior lock picking. Done. Anyway. These tools, hand ground for precision, oh. will let you pick lock. I forgot you can make her talk. Anyways, you actually can, I lied, switch off the mark of serenity here. But we're not going to, because this is more fun. Now we must find a eye before they find us. But the real good news is, is that we have devouring insects once more. I don't know about you, but I truly missed our carnivorous little friends. Alright. Just don't mind me, even though you're looking straight through a light, little ninjas. This is where stealth games get a little silly. I mean, I'm standing right in their field of view. I should... Okay, well, I got everyone killed. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty great, actually. I got everyone killed. They should be able to see me and shoot me from there. Alright, let's pull this. Pull this. And then, okay. Can I not get out of here properly? Let's go up there. Nope. Do I even need to kill them? Ah, no. Let's just, let's just go. Let's just go. That is obviously a waste of my time. Or, hey, hey buddy, I appear to be right behind you, okay. So it's not a waste of time, we need to figure out a way to get this door open. Oh my god, I don't want to dance. And go back over here. But yeah, final levels do tend to be this way, just kind of a little odd. And in my opinion, the dojo now has a completely different look from the dojo at the start of the game. Oh my god, that was a lot closer than I wanted it to be. And yes, that was actually the secret. This is the only instance I can actually think of that... This area is crawling with stalkers. It might be safer to duck into the subway tunnel and sneak past me. Well, we can do that, especially since they found us. No. No. That train was a little bit bigger than the other trains. Sometimes your train is just a little too big for what you're trying to fit it through. Uh, let's go over here and get in there. Oh no, 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 no. No. Oh, it's, I don't have my teleportation charged up. That's why things are going so poorly. So poorly, let's, let's just run away from everything and hide by this scroll. At sunset. Too the fast. entire clan Stop. takes part in the Kutsu Age and offers their gratitude to the one who has become an ancestor. A lesson and a warning. The master buries the remains in the shrine, in the heart of Isomujo. For without this death, the clan would not stand. Oh, I meant to show this off. As soon as I'm not being tracked. If you kill enemies in this level, and preferably don't kill them as I just did at where I'm going to get spotted immediately, um, well, it's going to be difficult for me to show this off now because this... <laughs> oh my god. That is the worst de decision I have made in this entire Let's Play. Okay, if you kill enemies, poof, they turn into, let's grab his body, grab his body, did his body just disappear? Well, his body disappeared. Now, I'm going to try and show off something slightly different than that. So let's just walk over here in the light and kill him. And his body turned into a ninja. 
Yes, that's right. The guards here are actually ninjas. Or are they? Or... Okay. That's okay, I guess. Well, alright then. Go ahead and kill him one more time. And let's be on our way in a more reasonable fashion. I don't, I don't know what the deal with that puzzle right there is. It's so simple if you just decide to go up. And yes, if you use Sarandi, you can teleport directly into cover. Which is, as you might imagine, extremely useful. I think that is the sniper, maybe, who killed us. I don't know, but I'm gonna pretend he is. I mean, he's actually a ninja, so this is a little weird. Let's move on. As I was saying, the mark makes you insane, and... Well, we're gonna have a lot to deal with that soon enough. Oh, hey! Instant death trap! Fantastic. Everyone loves an instant death trap. <laughs> I guess your giveaway here is that there's a little ledge here. A little bit strange. I, as always, am not fond of those types of traps, but that's okay. Let's just try and... Okay, that didn't work. I was trying to grab the ledge, and unfortunately, Cyber Ninjas, as you might have noticed, are extremely effective at taking you out. Now, I actually have a plan here. I think that, yes, I can get over these ledges using Serenity, and that will let us go around the building. This is the kind of thing you can do with Serenity in our levels, by the way, is you end up... And I can't actually go over. Well then, never mind. And how did I kill someone? We're back. Not much of a homecoming, is it? How did I kill someone? It's time to confront Azar. At this hour of the night, he must be in his garden. <laughs> ah, at least that was satisfying. Anyways, Azai is in his garden, and you know what that means. I hope, because I don't. Anyway, oh wait, I remember which way I have to go here. This is a very twisty, turny sort of level. And generally speaking, a lot of death is involved. Let's go ahead and break this light. And now that he's distracted, he will never notice, being that he's not a ninja, except he is a ninja, I don't know. It's weird. Hey, there we go. That's the first time you can actually see the ninja body in clear detail. So there you go. Huh. Mark of the Ninja is a lot of fun, though. And, ooh, look. I love this guy. He's just kind of floating there. And, of course, it's also filled with these kind of things. So, gone. Whenever it looks like there's a room like this that you can't get past without being spotted... Usually there's a trick in the next room or something like that if you haven't already come to discover that by watching the rest of this Let's we Play. We haven't set foot in here since we were students. And with another checkpoint behind us... Do you remember this test? The statue holds the lever tight, and you have to find the release. I don't know, by the way. I know people are probably asking, why do you have to do a random puzzle in the final level of Mark and the Ninja? that was for students, and I don't know. I just don't know. Let's see, I can't go up there. Let's wait for this sniper to... Ah, uh, nope. 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 Ah, I always make terrible decisions when I am playing this game for a video. What does this do? Oh god, that sets off spikes. Why? Why? Who would put a lever in a place to do that? Just, oh, if you pull this lever, you're gonna die. That's just so wrong. Anyway, oh, hey, that moves that. So, we won't worry about that, because instead... No. Oh, my God. I am so bad at everything. Let's turn on this light. Hey. Oh, okay. Okay. That's a little strange. And let's... Oh my god, all I wanted to do was get off the wall. That's all I wanted. That's it. That is it. And turn on this light. 
And I think that actually is everyone that... I think I have alerted everyone to my presence here and killed them. I am not a great ninja. <laughs> I've finally come to realize this. The statue lets go. And all those guards disappear because they weren't actually here. But then the real cyber ninjas show up. This is part of the test too. The doors will open on their own after a few moments. Just hold on. Yes, this is part of the test. This part of the test, which involves cyber ninjas, it's totally part of the original test. It That makes sense. We didn't totally change anything by letting them have the weapons or anything like that. Let's go ahead and turn off that light. And let's go in this little hole. I like going in little holes and hiding in tight spaces. It's open. Get out of there. Wait, what's open? Where's the door? Okay. Oh, the door is actually back the way we came. That makes sense. Oh, God, no. Well, it was a good run. But yes, you actually have to go out the way you came. Huh, and then it come back out over here. See what I'm saying? No one would ever build a dojo like this. Why would you ever build a dojo where you can only go through the air vents to get from one room to another? I mean, really? Who does that? How many times have I been discovered this episode? Now nothing stands between us and Azai. Well, it doesn't matter, because despite that terrible performance and dying several times, except maybe I didn't really die and it was just the mark deluding you. No, it was me dying, I'm sorry. We have met our master. Welcome home. And with that, we have finished the second to last level of Mark of the Ninja. If you want to see how this all turns out, then you'll have to join me in the next one. I hope to see you then.